Hello everyone. Welcome to another story session with Chavana ma'am. So today I am going to tell you a story about a baby mouse. Yes. And what is the story's name? I love you so much. Illustrated by Claude K. Dobbs. Now let's start. This morning when Lola woke up, she felt something special on the tip of her tongue. I know the word there are. She said to herself, I can feel them puffing out of my cheeks. See, Lola's cheeks are so puffed up because she wanted to tell something. Lola wanted to say her special word to daddy. But it was too late. He was already leaving for work. Lola wanted to say a special word to mommy. But mommy was very busy. Mommy, I want to tell you. Lola whispered. Can't it wait, angel? Said mama. You will be late to school. On the bus, it was too much noise for Lola to say her special word. At the playground, Lola walked up to her teacher. But the teacher was already holding a child. In the class, Lola looked over at the annoying boy next to her. I won't tell him a special word, she thought. At lunchtime, in the cafeteria, everybody was chewing and chopping. Lula kept quiet. Special words should not be chopped, she decided. During recess, all the children played running games. Lola didn't say a single word, special, specially not a special word. At school, Lola saw Frankie, a skateboarder king. Lola smiled. She decided to say her special word to him. But zoom, the rat sped past. Lola, without stopping, without waiting to hear her special word. But back on the bus, it was too noisy. Lola felt sulky now. At home in the living room, Lola sulked some more. Even when her parent got back home, Lola was sulking. She didn't feel like saying her special word anymore. So sad. Lola was so sad because nobody heard her special word. During supper, they met, felt hard. The meat felt hard. The salad felt mashy. And the lemonade was sour. What's wrong, Lola? Mama asked. Won't you tell us? Daddy asked. Lola thought long and hard. I won't say anything. She thought. Nobody cares. I am. I won't say a special word. But her cheek started puffing. It came up bigger, bigger and bigger. Suddenly Lola shouted. And she shouted. What did she shout? Mommy, Daddy, I love you. I love you. I love you so much. Finally, Lola said her special word. The word came flying out of her mouth and worked there magically. Instantly, Mommy and Daddy hugged Lola and kissed her cheeks. As she went upstairs to bed, Lola felt a little nervous. What if I 
if the special word don't come back tomorrow? She worried. But as soon as Lola turned off her lights and snuggled in her, into her bed, she felt happy. Tomorrow's special word was already on her tip of her tongue. So Lola again had a special word. Do you all have a special word to tell your parents? Do think about it. See you next time. Bye.